So we started Winnie on door manners. So it's following the same process we practiced last week. The sit, the yes, the okay. Yes, good girl. The only difference is before we release, yes. we are opening the door. Good. Okay. So if you notice, Shannon is giving the command. She's keeping the leash nice and loose. We only add pressure to the leash or pull on the leash if they're doing something wrong. Good girl. So Winnie's sitting, the loose leash is loose. Yes, good girl, she opened Winnie. the door. Is she still doing it? Yes. She if the answer is, is yes, good that little girl gets something good. How does she know when she can leave? Okay. Okay, and you girl, go ahead and go up first. So we want you to pick three doorways in your house, and it doesn't have to be a front door or a back door. It can be three two bedroom doors and a bathroom. You're going to have her put your leash on, have her sit in front of the door, open it. She should stay in the sit position until you give her the release word. Yes. And as you notice, yes. Shannon is adding a little bit more mm -hmm. distraction. Because she's so good. Because she's so good. Okay. We'll do one more door. So once you do it all the way through the three doors, in, out, in, out, in, out, right? Then if she's doing really good, do one more time with those three doors, except add something like Shannon did. Move side to side. Try to take a step inside the door, but she shouldn't come because remember, she shouldn't leave until she hears that release word. Nice loose leash, you open the door, add a distraction if she's doing well. Is she still doing it? If the answer is no, just shut the door or start all over. If she's doing good, mark that with the right word, yes, and reinforce. And she should stay in that position until she's released. End goal here is that you can have your dog sit, you walk out on the front porch, grab a package and come back in. That's what we're working towards real life. But until then, we gotta go with baby steps.